Okay, this is 639 Tarpon Avenue, two bedroom, one bath house, 756 square feet, right down the street from Robart Sports Arena. This house across the street here sold for 255000 in 2016, but it's a 322 with an outbuilding. This here is a 3-2 with a pool, and that sold for, I want to say, 285. You'd have to look it up to be sure. Driveway was added recently with the sidewalk. It has been recently painted. Front porch. House has vinyl plank flooring throughout. Any furniture that you see does stay. This is the dining room, living room combination. Kitchen comes with working appliances, I'm told. The bathroom was remodeled a few years ago, appears to be in good condition. In my opinion, the house is in moving, ready condition. Just needs a cleaning, dusting. It's definitely rent ready within a day or two. The second bedroom in here could be considered the master. Actually has two closets, one there, and one here, as well as storage up top. This is in the city of Sarasota limits, city limits. So the water and sewer is provided by the city. Out on the back porch, which is screened in, is where the washer and dryer would go, right here against this wall. It has a deck with a sunshade out here. There is a fence on three sides. It's a big lot, big enough for a large pool. This outbuilding has electric only in it, so there's no water and no sewer. The current owner uses it as a storage for lawn tools and his stuff. Not really a livable space, but it could be.
I believe the lot size is 8,800 plus square feet. These buildings are common in this neighborhood. Some people rent them out for it to be legally zoned right. You need to be the homestead owner of the property and then you can rent it according to a recently passed City of Sarasota ordinance. They're called Granny Flats. There are no deed restrictions in this neighborhood. Cars with riding, vans with riding, boats, trailers are okay. Vans with riding, any business is okay to run from here. The air conditioner is old. It's approaching its useful life, as is the roof. But the air conditioner blows cold. The best that I can tell, electrical panel was replaced in 2000. It looks like 10 or 12. Um, inspector will tell you for sure. Uh, roof is probably, it's not leaking now, but it has approached its useful life as well. Six thirty nine Tarpon Avenue. For more information, please text Dave Brown nine four one three two zero seven four three six. Thanks for watching.